Good afternoon, and welcome once again to my daily chat. This is episode number 610, or 610, easier to say it that way. And the title of the topic today is why you wouldn't want to work, sorry, excuse me, why you wouldn't want to coach with me. Yeah, I'm going to go there. So before I do, let me introduce myself so you know who I am and why you would, <laughs> and what I'm about, so maybe why you would want to, but um, I don't want to guess, I want to show my hand too early. So my, my name is Barry Selby. I'm a best-selling author, speaker, and relationship attraction expert. And I help strong, successful, and high-achieving women create balance in love, life, and business. Because I'm a passionate champion for the divine feminine. That's a clue, by the way. And I'm also, um, that's also what inspired these talks I've done now for over two years, called Messages from the Masculine, Inspiring Your Feminine Heart. Although well, those talks do speak to men and women. So this is my um, daily chat at 5 p.m. Pacific time, Facebook Live. And yes, if you're watching on YouTube, that's where it was first. I'll give you the links to those at the back end. And so I'm up to episode number 610. And the topic today is one I thought I'd find, I've been holding this up my sleeve for a while, but I thought, let me put it on the table, is why you wouldn't want to coach with me. And I'll give you some very good reasons why you wouldn't. Maybe I'll give you some clues why you would. But again, I'm jumping ahead of myself. So, um, Let's jump into this, shall we? And I appreciate questions, comments, thoughts, interactions as well, because being Facebook Live, it can be interactive. And if you want to share with other people, feel free to share it out as well. So why wouldn't you want to coach with me? First of all, because you don't need any help. <laughs> Simply put, you've got it together. Your life is perfect. There's no need for any support of any kind. And life is going perfectly and all is well. In which case, congratulations. You're one of the very few people that has that going on. Then again, um, Sorry, Carrie, oh, wouldn't want to coach with me because you call us on our shit and force us to transform. <laughs> Carrie, you're leaking out my truth. <laughs> I'll get to that. You're jumping ahead of me. And, th and thank you for all you've done. You're very welcome. Um, it's my mission and my purpose. <laughs> thank you for that, Carrie. I appreciate it. But you're getting ahead of the game. I'm, I'm, play I'm, I'm leading up to that. I'm starting with the simple stuff first. So first of all, your life is perfect. Everything's going great. At least that's what you tell yourself. Because if you're like most people, that's not really the reality. It's what you show to the world, but not what you show to other people. But I'll get to that in a minute. Not the reason you wouldn't want to work with me. Um, actually, I'll, I'll sidetrack. Because Carrie already leaked it out, I'll say that true. Is you don't want to have your shit called on. You like to keep yourself nice and safe, no risks, not doing anything. You want to keep everything on the surface and not have any um, ripples on your nice, still surface where everything's perfect. Kind of leads to the first one as well. That's another reason you want to want to, want to, want to coach with me. So that's, so that's 1A, not it was part two. And third reason, basically, why you wouldn't want to coach with me um, is because you don't give a, sh a flying... <laughs> I was going to say it that way. You don't give a flying F about your dating life. In fact, you don't... And I'm going to say another way. You don't give a flying F about your relationship life. You go on dates, you don't care, you have fun, you swipe right, you meet people, have a great time, maybe some sex, and that's all you need. Great then you don't need to talk to me and I don't want to talk to you either. I'm glad we're clear about that. Number four, um, another reason why you, might not, why you wouldn't want to coach with me is that you really are afraid of facing yourself. In fact, you'd rather avoid it at all costs, in which case working with anybody, especially with me, because I've got some skills in this area, where it's much easier to pretend everything's fine. Again, this, this veneer thing is going to come up a lot because for many people, living to the veneer level of their life is the only way they're going to live. And anything other than that is either too scary, too painful, too weak, or just simply not safe to do. And that for me is one of the reasons why I talk about this stuff, because if you've watched any of my broadcasts, I don't pull punches. <laughs> Far from it. And if you watch any of my broadcasts lately, I've been talking a lot about how being single is a good thing. So why you wouldn't want to work with me might be because you'd rather stay single and isolated than risk being in a relationship again. In which case, you wouldn't want to work with me either because if that's where you're stuck and you want help, I would give it to you. But if you don't want to do anything with it and you don't want to have any help, then stay where you are and be safe. And I mean safe in a very limited perspective because the true thing for me is that when you're really vulnerable and open, that's when you're really safe. But most people don't want to deal with that. So that's why you wouldn't want to work with me. Um, that's number four, I think. So number five, yes, number five. Another reason why you wouldn't want to coach with me is because you don't care about having any fun or joy in your life. 
<laughs> the truth is when I work with my clients, they tend to be thriving and happy and joyful. And if you don't want any of that in your life, you don't want to work with me. So that's really clear. Okay, that's number five. I'm giving you the shorthand because I'm going to actually cut to the chase at the back end of this, as you may be suspecting. Again, if you watch my broadcast, you know I don't usually avoid the stuff. So I'm going to dive into the deep part in a moment. Number six, another reason why you wouldn't want to coach with me. Um, well, actually, I'll put it this way. You're in an amazing relationship and you don't need help because you're already in a relationship. That's kind of an obvious one, I know, because I work with singles. Um, occasionally with couples, but mostly with singles. But if you're already in a happy relationship, maybe it's going great and you don't plan on leaving it and everything is perfect, even better. So you wouldn't want to work with me because there's no need to, unless you want to tune up. But that's another story. Number that's six, number seven. So let me throw another one on the table. And I, these are dropping as they drop in. I, I'm literally saying and the next one is and it shows up because I don't have a script or a bullet list for this. I'm just talking about what's top of mind and downloading. So another reason why you wouldn't want to coach with me. Um, well, <laughs> here's another one. You're actually coaching with somebody else, and that's fine. I don't cross. I don't cross um, pollute with other coaches. Can I cross pollute? Uh, why? Why you wouldn't want to work with me? You're working with somebody else. And that's great. I only work with people who want to work with me because I know what I do, and I know when I work with my clients, I want them to be really working on the stuff I provide for them. So that's a very clear, un a clear boundary there. So that's number seven. Let's see. If there's a, let's see. If there's a number eight out there. So. Reason number eight why you wouldn't want to coach with me. Um, you can't handle the English accent. I'm, I'm, being re I'm reaching for this one. <laughs> but maybe you only work with American coaches. C'est la vie, that's, that's your choice. But maybe there's some actual skill set I bring that may be more helpful. So that's number, number eight. Oh, yes, number, number nine. Let's see if I can get 10 out of this one. Number, number nine, the number ninth reason why you wouldn't want to coach with me is that you'd really rather not work with a man who understands women. You'd rather work with a woman who understands women or a man who doesn't understand women. Yeah, like that. So that's that to think about too. Um, yeah, I'll say that for the later. All right, so number 10, let's see if I can come up with number 10 because I, I didn't plan on doing more than three. So I've got this high, I'm pretty impressed with myself for this one. So the 10th reason why you wouldn't want to coach with me. Let me see what it's going to be because I've already covered so many. Hang on a second as I think, let this one drop in. Ah. <laughs> Maybe the biggest one of all is you don't believe you can have what you want. And that's the killer for a lot of people. They simply don't believe it's possible to have joy in their life, to have love in their life, to have what they really want. And so working with me, you wouldn't want to do that because that I don't agree with that. So that's giving you 10 good reasons to start with. So let me just throw the other side, or let me turn the other side over, which Carrie already called out on me earlier, right at the beginning, is if you are glimpsing a possibility that you can actually have what you really want here, but you don't know how to get there, that's where my work is especially strong. If you're someone who has been dreaming of an amazing relationship and never been trusting you could actually have it and not believing you could have it, we should talk. If you're someone who basically is fed up with the fact that life isn't going the way you want, especially around love and relationships, and you wish there was another way, we should talk. And by the way, I'm gonna put a link in the comments for a discovery session because that's where it starts. We have a conversation to see where you are and where I am, and if it lines up, we wanna work together because the other thing is, is I don't work with everybody. One, I haven't got space in my calendar, and two, most people aren't gonna do the work because as Carrie so poetically put it, is that I do call my clients on their shit and help you transform. I don't force them, I encourage them. So it's a little different. So um, if you're not ready for that, <laughs> you don't want to reach out to me, I can tell you now. So there was another piece that was gonna drop in there. Oh yes. One of the biggest things I bring to my conversation with my clients is I love and support and cherish my clients. And a lot of people are not willing to have that because they don't feel safe being loved. That's one of those boundaries a lot of people are meant to cross. And I don't mean anything beyond the fact that as a coach, I have great support and care for my clients because I want them to get what they want. And that's one of my passions, which is why I do this work. And why I've done 610 Facebook Lives about this stuff. It's kind of in my wheelhouse. Um, there's one other thing I was gonna put on the table, which was something on the lines of, when you work with me, I can guarantee you, your life won't be the same as it was at the beginning. 
Now that could be good or bad depending on you look at it, <laughs> just to be transparent. But I'm gonna help you see your life differently than you did when we first started working together. And that's one of my gifts. And for some people it's a curse. <laughs> but I'm very passionate about my clients having what they want. And if you're not ready for that, or you're not willing to have that, or you don't believe you can have that, then I'm just gonna say, don't even consider reaching out to me. And I'm being intentional about this because I really am being selective. I only have room at any one time. Right now I'm keeping only room for up to seven clients at any one time because that's as many as I can fit in my calendar and give them the dedication I wanna give them. So I can't and I won't take on more than that. So that's so you know if you're interested, you won't be one of 20,000 people. Now, if you're getting my online programs and products, then yes, you can have those because they don't require my time. Those are already out there for you to use. And in fact, you know, I was gonna just, I'm, you can, <laughs> I'm sitting with a choice about what I was gonna put in the list of links at the end of the broadcast. I'm putting the link in for my discovery session because if you, this appeals to you, and if you haven't found that one of those 10 things is your um, line you won't cross, then I'm gonna give you a discovery session so you can have a chat with me offline or privately. But I'm gonna put, a, I, I'm gonna put a couple of things in the comments. So two things I always promote, which I'm gonna talk about now because they're relevant to this as well. One of my fundamental things I help my clients do is learn to fall in love with themselves again. Because a lot of people out there have lost the ability to love themselves because of what they've been told by their ex-partners, by their parents, by other people, so they don't even know how to love themselves. So my self-love practice and the guided meditation I provide has simple tools in it that help you get where you want, where you get to a place where you love yourself enough to risk the next step, which is to reach out for love from other people. So that's part of my offering. That'll be in the links too. The other one I'm dropping, that's two. So the third one I'm dropping in the links is the, um, the new um, offering that I put together. I don't have a name for it really. It's, it's a guidebook, it's a, it's a teaching. It's seven modules that help you get where you want, what you want in life, called your best life. And your best life is meant to do that for you. It helps you strategize, plan, vision, and create the life you really dreamed of. And that is for everybody, men and women, and it actually works on all areas, not just relationship, or you can focus on that one as well as other areas if you want to. But it's simple, powerful tools that let you create a vision for your life that works. That's your best life, and it's gonna be in the comments when I sign up as well. So I've given you 10 reasons why you wouldn't wanna work with me. I've given you three four things where you can reach out with links to do stuff with me. That's an even scale. <laughs> so thanks for the love, Jermaine. Good to see you in my broadcast. Thank you, sir. Nice to see you. Um, but that's the thing, is that this is the work for those who choose into it. I will not work with clients who don't want to do the work. I, can't, I won't force myself on people because frankly, it's more work for me than I want to do. But if you want to do the work and you want to transform your life, this is my offering. And this is why I do this work. And why I do these talks every day? Because I know there is um, value to be had. Transformation, 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 excuse me, transform, what's it? Transformation to go through and love and success to have at your fingertips. So if that interests you, choose one of the links in the comments and, and sign up and start right now. I think that's really about it. I really want to have fun and just play with this one, which I think I did. So you've got 10 reasons why you wouldn't want to work with me and a few reasons why you would. And the simple put is this, if any of those things, you're welcome. Thank you, Jermaine, you're very welcome. Um, if you are, if those 10 really trigger you, like going, oh, I don't wanna do those things, that's another reason why you do wanna work with me. So with that, that's my marketing promotion for today. I appreciate you being with me as always, and I'll be back in tomorrow. If you haven't seen my broadcast before, by the way, I do this on Facebook Live, 5 p.m. Pacific time, every day, to join me every day of the week, seven days a week. Sunday will be different because it's Super Bowl Sunday and I'm gonna be at a party. So I'm letting you know ahead of time, that'll be probably be later in the evening or maybe early depending on, I'll announce on Facebook. So watch me on Facebook, you'll know when I go live. Secondly, um, the replays for this, if you haven't seen my broadcast before, is first of all, they're on my personal page on Facebook where I go live, which is facebook.com forward slash Barry Selby. The replays go onto my business page on Facebook as well as onto YouTube and on my podcast. I'll give you the links for those so you can find them. On Facebook, my business page is facebook.com forward slash Barry Selby dot author. On YouTube, you can find me under Barry, Barry Selby as well. My social media is all my name. So Twitter, LinkedIn, all that stuff is Barry Selby. Hi Della, good to see my broadcast. You missed my 10 reasons why you wouldn't want to work with me. <laughs> I had fun with it. And uh, so replays, so YouTube, if you go to my YouTube channel, which is um, 
youtube.com forward slash user forward slash Barry Sorby. And you can find on there a playlist called Messages for the Masculine. Please subscribe, by the way. And then you can go ahead and watch any of my replays, all 609 plus this one, 610 broadcasts. And by the way, just so you know, um, about four days ago, Facebook had a glitch and it's still got the glitch. It may have been changed today. We'll see that my Facebook lives are not being saved in high def. And so they look a bit grainy. You can hear them fine, but I look a bit pixelated, which is not my favorite view. <laughs> so, but the content's still there, so you may enjoy it. Um, hey, Mary Jo, thanks for being with me. Appreciate you being the broadcast. Um, YouTube, so YouTube channel, YouTube playlist, watch that. And finding my podcast is on iTunes, which is Messages from the Masculine. You can subscribe to my podcast, and that's the audio versions of these. I've only got a few of them out there so far. More are coming later, um, but that just helps if you another way of looking at my work. So again, I'll put links in the comments for my discovery session, self-love practice, and your best life, because they all rock and they'll help you. And if you have any questions about this, please put in the comments below. And if you want to share it with somebody you know, please share it with them. And with that, I thank you for watching. Um, this has been kind of cathartic for me. <laughs> thank you, Dale. I appreciate it. Yes, I I'm, appreciate being being received. So thank you for thank you. You're extremely informative. I I love I love all the love. So thank you for that so much from or you and everybody else. With that, I thank you for watching. Um, this is my daily chat, 5 p.m. Pacific time. Again, Sunday will be different. I don't know when it'll be before or after Super Bowl because I'm going to go up and have some fun. It's the Allied Rams. You know, I've got to support the local team. And uh, with that, I thank you for watching. I will see you again tomorrow, definitely at 5 p.m. Pacific time. Take care of yourself. If you have any questions about love and romance, seek me out. I'll see you again tomorrow. Take care. Bye.